Hey guys, this is your friend and pal, the fearsome rubber ducky, with a, another video for y'all. Um, I'm facing rather easy buccaneer, cause, uh, well, I just started out, actually. Took me a while to find this recording, but I remember that I gave some good advice to a new player who's more used to Wizards 101, he thinks this is a stat-based game, so I'm trying to set him right on that. Uh, gave him some advice about gear, for example. I told him, um, uh, you need to, uh, have at least two fortresses two valor's fortresses and at least one assassin strike and probably a heal on buccaneer um and also um and also he isn't using pete i'm giving you advice about using pete and what to set him with if you get pete you need to give him vengeance strike three for sure uh probably relentless two and blade storm two some max accuracy and um some max health and um, also some damage and stuff. So, oh yeah, and max strength. Uh, Gordonando's almost the same, so he can't do a second blade storm, uh, or at least you don't want a second blade storm. So, also you see he's wearing that monkey. He's he he has a lot of his stuff just because of his stats. So he's trying to get he's trying he's trying to do what all Wizards 101 players who start out with this game do. And look, he totally forgets both my reduces. I told him, watch out for those, okay? You got to time your charging sequences. So, yeah, I'm telling him, as far as equipping gear goes, you need to equip two forts and uh, at least one assassin if you're a buccaneer. And watch me reduce them. Remember those reduces. You gotta watch out for those. See how I just eat right through his armor? Because... The block damage from Buccaneers don't block everything, so... Yep. And he's like, uh, he's, re he's regretting getting Gornando. I'm like, Gornando's not bad if you set him right. So he gave him a bunch of ridiculous stuff. I don't even remember what it was, but it was just not like the good stuff like Vengeance Strike 3. Vengeance Strike 3 is OP if you're a Buccaneer. Um, so yeah, and I'm telling him, oh yes, yes, the main thing about Buccaneers in this uh, ranked PvP is you want to use the ability called Highland Charge, which doubles your movement, especially since you have the boxes in the way that really helps. <laughs> he is decent. <laughs> He's talking about Grenando. That's funny. Well, uh, if you're new to this game, I hope some of the advice I gave you was helpful in some way. Uh, I have more entertaining videos for those of you who are um, more interested in matches where I actually fight some hard people. Um, this is mostly for the new people who want advice on Buccaneer. So anyway, I hope this is helpful uh, or entertaining or we thought it was, would be helpful for somebody else. So go ahead and smack that like button and I will probably see you in the next video. That is it and peace out. Well, the match is almost over. I'll say peace out again. Okay, come on. Come on. Let's, let's, let's hurry up and peace this thing. Okay, here we go, and GG, and peace out.